All right, people. Welcome back. More daily duels. This video might be late. Might I can't I can't guarantee, but it might be late. Uh, really busy with league. Really extremely busy with league. And uh, I mean, I do apologize that if it is up late. Uh, go ahead and play Shujin Sage, and of course we're playing uh, Man Warriors, but busy with League, really. Uh, as usual, like in Daily Duels, I like, as, unless it's tag, I like to update you guys on how's the progression, you know, we've got course warning, uh, how League is going. Well, to update you guys on that, uh, all the decks are in, everybody's got their decks, they're working on it, so it's more just the, the behind the scenes stuff. Uh, just literally, just before I uh, recording this, sat down with uh with Stanzi and with Slate and because Slate of course uh, helps me get all the guest uploads and work to unfinalize the script. You guys you guys might have already seen that uh, that intro. That's gonna be in the intro. It's just the first couple of seconds. The the beat will drop because I kinda left you hanging on that and then I'll start getting into the script of course and uh, talking about season two. So you gotta finalize the script, script when you find gotta memorize it and work on it and get in front of the camera and do that. So that's that's important. We need to we need to still get the art from Lunar because we're still missing a couple of teams art wise from him. Get that. After we get that, right, it's obviously blue eyes because I mean they love Melee the Winking Dragon. It's Melee the Winking Dragon. Pitch Melee the Winking Dragon so you can make sure you get your shit. So I'm assuming you got a blue eyes and of course the alternate. That's fine. <clears throat> Next turn, I can go ahead and bust out my uh, my big ass uh, condom, my magnum. I'm <laughs> gonna keep calling him that, and he's just the magnum. So are you gonna blow me up and not attack, or are you gonna attack do the fifth? Okay, I was thinking, I was, I was kind of debating which one you were gonna do because you could do 15, but then you go to the hand, so maybe you just want to blow me up, not attack, then remain on the field unless you're gonna go ahead and do some kind of synchro play as such. I mean, either way, it's totally fine. <laughs> All right, definitely seems like you're gonna go ahead and do a synchro play. I'm just getting kind of sick and tired of seeing blue. One of my friends has blue eyes, and it's just I'm, I, I see this deck all the fucking time. It's a really great deck. Like I could, I could see this deck winning worlds. Like I really can, especially if Chaos Max comes out at that time. Just think about it. Like so many decks are nerfed, and Blue Eyes has Chaos Max, four thousand Magic Specter as monster. Like what the fuck can you do against that? Sometimes you know, like sh what you could play like. PK, but what does PK do? I mean, they have a hard enough time against the Cosmos along with fucking Chaos Max, so that, that could definitely be a struggle as well. Alright, so. I'm gonna pitch her and summon Blue Eyes, so that's 3,000 gone right there. Ooh, interesting art. It has Cop on it and everything. I don't think I've ever seen that art of uh, uh, Blue Eyes. I'm getting off topic. So, send that art. Uh, ooh! Ooh, alright, and then go to Twin Burst. Didn't see that coming at all, so this card can't be destroyed by battle, right? Yeah, just straight up cannot be destroyed by battle. And it can make up to two attacks on monsters. On monsters. Alright. I was wondering if I was going to get my shit kicked in, but no. It's just like, oh no, only on monsters. That's fine, because I can just negate you with my effects. Because I can just revive my, uh... My, uh... My, uh... One of my electromagnetic warriors. So, we already got, uh... Parizion? They changed it to a B? I thought it was a V! I thought it was... Bear... Bear... Bearzion. I thought it was Verzion or Verzion, a Pokemon. Like, no, no, it's changed to a B now. Okay. So, go ahead and summon that. We can go ahead and poly it up. Because that's what this deck does. Like, this is a powerful play. They have such high consistency of getting these two, especially with the Searcher, Drake and Alpha. Just bust that out. I do have him, so I can therefore summon him. Going to Kara, Kara, Kara Gorkon? Is that her name? Oh, well, sure. I mean,. I thought your effects were negated, but no, your effects are not negated. So I summon and I can go ahead and grab that guy. I have another one in you because I already have the Gamma. So that's good. Next time I can just go Gamma, summon Alpha, uh, Alpha, search me Berizion, go into like another freaking Gorgon if I feel like it, and then I will have all three of them in the graveyard and my freaking, uh, and my, uh, and my boss monster. So that's pretty powerful. I mean, it really doesn't matter what I detach, really. So go ahead and detach. You, drop you down to zero and destroy that booty hole. Howler. <laughs> Sorry, Kyla. There goes a nice chunk out of your life point. I was like, I was like, how did you get your life point so low? But then I remember you did the War for Art Thou, so. Uh, isn't it called like something else? Like, uh, yeah, no, it's War for Art Thou. Oni Chan. <laughs> One Chan? I think it's supposed to be Oni Chan? One Chan. Uh. Uh. <laughs> So he paid 2000 to grab that search, which is fine. And now, I mean, come on, I got my fucking Magna, I got my Condom, and I got my fucking Gorgon. Like, whoo, that's power. So, yeah. 
the league is it's working on. We're working on. It. We're getting going ahead. Once we get that art, we're gonna do the big explanation video for season two that people will see once they come over from other people's channels and guest uploads. That's great. All right, look at the title. I hate this class. I hate this class so much. So, um, if you guys know or you should know, personal life, uh, I'm still in college. Uh, despite being the summertime, I'm in this accelerated magnet. Uh, magnet. That's high school. Accelerated program in my university where I have a class every month. A two different teacher, a different class every single month to try to speed up my process of becoming a teacher. So while, you know, usually it would take a while to become a, uh, it's fine. No, wait, no, it's not fine. No, wait, no, it's not fine. I should have negated that. Should have negated that. I figured I should have negated that, but then it would still go grab, but at least he wouldn't get the revival, you know? Yeah, should have negated that. That was that was dumb. I got two big negates. That, that's power, but I shouldn't negate it there. That way, even if it, he would be the graver for a dragon or something, but he wouldn't have summoned the fucking dragon. Like, it's the negate. I was thinking it was okay because I was like, well, he's gonna summon a dragon, but then he can't be destroyed, so I can't fuck it with it anyway. But no, I should have. Should have killed it. Should have killed it. <laughs> should have killed it. That's all you're gonna do. Then you're going to die. Cause I'm just gonna tack over you. Even if you tag out, tack over you, tack you for 16 games. So. This looks like it might be game. Yeah. Oh wow. Otherwise, I mean, I don't think Magnet Warriors are going to be out by the time Worlds comes around. It's a TCG, so. But I know in Blue Eyes, I mean, the majority of shit's already there. You can go ahead and tag out if you want to. I'll just attack that one too, because you only have 3,000 booty. I got 4,000 right here. My condom is way bigger than, than you can handle. <laughs> that sounds weird. So, I have a different teacher each month, right? The teacher that I'm currently in, and I'm almost done with it. Like, you know, it's almost the end of June. I hate this class. I hate the teacher. I hate everything about it. Like, I I just did the freaking uh, survey. Oh, right. Because uh, you can block yourself in destruction. That's fine. But you battled a rock monster that you didn't die. Therefore, get bounced. Magnet field. Powered. Yep. Powered. I, thought, I, I bet he's thinking he's cute. He's like, okay, he'll attack me. I won't die because freaking gospel, I'll live. But then I'm like, no, 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 no. You didn't die. Magnet field. Bounce back. And this is already, you know, during what, the damage step, or you can't even chain, get out, hop out of the way, and then kill you anyway, so. Yep, see? Fucking, hmm, stack. So powerful. This, this on top of it. Like, if it didn't have this, eh, but because it's just like, you just use two manual warriors in your hand and bust out this motherfucker, it's like, ah, oh, so good. Alright, we'll get another duel. Bear back. <sighs> so, literally, the teacher, like, I only went in one class. Wow, I already got my boss muster right now. You made me go first? Yeah. I'll tell you always. And then this is the Electrodark Warrior. It's not even that good to open up with, right? It's also when you special summon another one from your hands. So, yep. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, I guess we'll just go ahead and activate King of Swamp and Dex then. That way I don't draw into another Poly, hopefully. So he knows I'm playing something with Poly, but he has no idea what it is. So I think that's, that's information, but that's not enough information to the point where I'm like, oh, fuck, you know? So he knows I have Poly. I, I didn't I didn't choose in some of this turn, so maybe he's thinking right, maybe I don't have it. Oh Hill uh one 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 always one. Heroes? Hill Oh no, maybe. I don't know. Damn, fucking number generator though. Like one reasoning, one regeki, like ill <laughs> That is not what I wanna see, not at all. Okay. I mean did the reasonings already get hit down to one? Yeah, but it's cool. So is that all you're gonna do? I'm kind of wondering if there's actually like a big old threat that you're gonna bust out. So I don't know, that's fine. So I don't want to pitch a spell, that's fine. Oh, broke ass insta fusion for that broke ass Norton plays. Ah. Uh, Shadow Mist? I believe I can handle that. Graffer, okay. I was thinking, I was thinking maybe Dark Law deck, but no. There's Shadow Mist. Okay. And Mally, of case, of course, played Mally shenanigans, of course. Should've known, should've known, should've known, so. They got lucky with that, uh, with that, uh, reasoning for the Plague play, so. Double sink gate, I'm assuming. It goes into Beals? No. Beals this. Ew. Ew, I don't think I can handle that. Like, I'm not warning that. Like, I, I can't, I can't. He's a 4,000 meter, can't be destroyed by battle. Like, even if I fucking fuse, like, I'm still fucked. Actually, he might be, but he can end this game right now, actually. Never mind, never mind, I'm dead. I'm dead, I'm dead. I'm dead because he can just go ahead and do the Mally play plague play two bills and tack tack. I'm dead. Like that's it. That's game or Voidogar or whatever. Yeah, that's game. What? You didn't do the other play? 
Oh my god, he went into Void Ogre, so I'm assuming he's gonna set this card and then he can negate my poly. That fucking sucks. What? You didn't. Why the fuck? Why the fuck? Why the fuck would you go into Void Ogre when you have no set card? When you have something in your hand that's dumb. Like. That was dumb. That was just. I thought uh, you could have killed me right now. Well, no, because you already banished the plague. Never mind. You couldn't have killed me. But this? Really? With this? Like, why not build? Like, builds would have been much better. Much better. I got the Prisma, but I think I'd rather just go ahead and fuse with these two in my hand. Well, I guess he can go ahead and substitute for something else. I'm not really planning on using my normal summon, but I would get a little bit less damage. But then I would keep more resources in my hand. Hmm. Would I? Use these two and keep that in my hand for later, or keep this in my hand for later and infuse. Nah, I, I think I should go ahead and summon Prisma. I'm Prisma, go ahead and reveal. I said it really doesn't matter, I keep you in my hand. So I guess I'll send one of you. I'm good thing that Prisma can go ahead and come back. So go ahead and just be using my boss monster. So Prisma plus you equals Magnum, big old condom. Go ahead and run over your Void Ogre that you went into instead of going into Bills, which so Bills would have been a much better choice, but we're good. I have 3,000 life points up. And he surrenders! Oh, God. Thank God, thank God that he did that fucking plague play differently. I was thinking about the new Dawson Cape, and I forgot he had to play went to the grave war, therefore he, it was gonna get banished. So, jumped ahead of the gun. I was like, I was like, oh shit. I'm so used to playing in the double melee, double sync 8, and then it just beat in game. But nope. He went to Void Ogre for some reason, then. Magnum, my big condom, you're low on resources in this game, so. Yay! Ooh, you got lucky with that reasoning though. Like, just reasoning right into that plague spare. Like, oh, come on. All right, we'll get another duel. Bear back. All right, another duel. So, the whole the whole class it sucks. Uh, it's supposed to be an online class, but you can go in on Thursdays for two hours in the class, and you, there's some work that you're able to do in class that you would usually have to be extra work on at home online. Correct. One of the <laughs> I went the first day, I did not enjoy myself. I didn't like the teacher, I didn't like how the class was structured. I really don't like the people that are already okay. <laughs> we are back again. I mean my hand wasn't great either. I tried to not, I tried to number to the the poly. I'm running one fusion phase and one freaking fun. Tried to number to rate that poly. It's pretty powerful, so. He made me go first? God damn it, I hate going first. Uh I uh, hate going first. Yeah, I guess I have to reveal my deck just so I can get play set up. I didn't even open up with like the the magnet way that you really want to open up with. Like I think I'd rather open up with Alpha because at least Alpha can then search beta but like there's no poly here. I got one three polys, fusion sage and slime. Those two at one to try to number generate but yeah this, this opening hand's kinda dead. Like unless I get poly then I'm not really doing anything with anything with the rest of this hand so I don't know. I thought maybe that'd be enough. The one one three just to make sure I get the poly but if I don't open up with it, then these guys are kind of dead, so maybe I should increase the, the poly count. Maybe I should, should run. It would be great if I could use Slime as one of the targets, but I can't. I can't. Only only Prisma can do it. Because he actually becomes a name while she's in stage is like, hey, I'm just a sub, just a two, so. I probably shouldn't have let that Armageddon Knight go through, but I think I'd rather save this strike for something maybe more threatening. More Plague shenanigans. Ah, oh, Fucking Plague, man! <laughs> Ah, uh, I remember when Plague Fighter was hit. <laughs> like, <coughs> such shenanigans, like... I'm gonna send him to the graveyard and fucking go off. I'm assuming Coral Dragon. Coral Dragon? No. Yeah, I'm gonna strike that. Because one, I don't want you to draw, and two, uh, you're stronger than me. So, and you use your normal summon, so I'll just go ahead and cut that out. And then you go ahead and insta fusion Norton, and then fuck me up anyway, so... I'd rather go ahead and strike that. Alright, it's still not the best. I need Polly, I got another strike. Like, I got this. I'm just gonna take this little stream with stuff. It'd be nice if they had like a fusion so I can go ahead and start sending, you know, not these two with Prisma, but there's, there isn't, so. <sighs> and I'm not running any kind of, uh. Probably should put a four in here. Like, I do have Prisma. No, wait, you're three. I'm not thinking you're four, because all the other freaking. No, you're only three, so. The only fourth I got is Prisma. Still not the best of hand. I mean, can I take his flow? Can I literally just halt all his plays? Strike, and just draw a strike every turn? I mean, strike is at three, not my fault. They're fucking keep drawing into that. I'd much rather draw into a poly. Like, I'm going to strike. So you can go ahead and overextend to another play. I'll hit you with another strike and I just talk that. No, you're just gonna take it slow. You can set a monster, okay. 
Uh, maybe a Raikou or something? Drew into another Alpha. Okay. Well, if I'm drawn to another alpha, I might as well go ahead and summon get another surge so it's fine because this time, you know, plus eight. And then I can just go into Gorgonic Guardian, which is the case if it's something to fuck me up, then I can just negate it during, you know, during the damage step because she can go off during the damage step because Gorgonic Guardian is a boss ass bitch. Like, you already know. Like, she she makes this deck so much better. So I'll go ahead and pack. I'm thinking maybe a Raikou? Goblin Zombie. Oh, I can't get that. Like, you hit your dead, you go to the graveyard, you go, I mean, I guess I could have striked it, but like I said, I'd, I'd rather go ahead and hit something else. So, for now, I'm fine. I'm still afraid of Insta-Fusion Northern, of course, because the when I wouldn't have that fun, it would kick someone in the mouth. So I could just go ahead and just negate you. I, I mean, <laughs> is the sending the cost? No, you target one monster on the field, and then do that, so... I think I'm just gonna go ahead and hit you with the Golgotha Guardian, because I don't want you to send. Why, right, so you can send Mizuki and do that shenanigans? Oh, no, thank you. Just go ahead and shh, shh, you zombie. I'm glad your hand is so good. I mean, my hand's not that great <laughs> either. Okay, I mean, your effect's negated. You don't send for costs. You don't send for costs. <laughs> just shh. Every time. Wow, this would be nice if I had one more frickin' uh, level 3 earth, like, but I don't, so I guess I would just go ahead and uh, attack. Still waiting on Polly, still waiting on a lot of things, so handle Unizombie really well. Like, <laughs> shut, up, shut his ass up, and he didn't get the fact, like, he didn't get the fact, and he's dead. Like, that's nice, that's nice. That was, that was a good point. Anyway, I don't like this, I really don't like the students. They're all, like, really, like, like it's weird. It's like... They're goody do they're really, really goody two shoes. Like I'm probably like the biggest rebel in my class. I'm also the youngest. But also. Okay, well, that's not what I want to see at all. Like. So you'll go ahead and attack into me. Of course I'll go ahead and use Gorgonic Guardian to kill you, and then you could just do your mid your plague Mally plays in main phase too. So not the biggest fan of that. Not the biggest fan of that at all. So go ahead and does Mizuki banish for cost? He does. If he banishes for cost, I will strike that. I was wondering if he, if he did it for cost. Like, I was wondering if he activated, because if he just activated and he didn't banish for cost, then suck me, but he banishes for cost, strike him. No more. And I, like, I don't know what your hand is, he's got five cards, but you know, we're going kind of back and forth. Oh, BAs. Why not? There's still BAs and everything. Like I said, it's kind of just Dante, and he didn't go into a BA. Uh, once again, still not getting anything. <laughs> uh, I can I can summon another Gorgonic Guardian. I said I don't know how useful the fucking Farfa is, but I kind of don't want to use my effect on Farfa. I think I'll just go ahead and summon, and then just special summon because it's not like this way. It's that useful. Now I just need one more of my freaking plays, and of course, guess who we're going into? Guess who we're going into, people? Did anybody guess Gorgonic Guardian because he's a boss ass bitch? Like, hell yeah! No, 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 I don't feel like using my effect. Like, Farfa's not really too much of a threat unless... Well, I guess if you fucking banish me and then I come back with no materials, it's kind of a threat. I didn't really think of that before ending my turn, but you were going to get that effect whether I like that or not. Oh, well, might as well use my effect. Got another fucking Mizuki. Great. God damn it! I'm not drawing into any of my plays, and he start. He's slowly starting to pick up pace. Okay, well, I'm dead. I mean, I was gonna die either way, right? I mean, unless you want to go. Okay, I was gonna die either way. So, Regeki, it's the screams. So I need it at all. <laughs> oh my god! I'm not drawing into anything. Where are my polys? Where's my other fucking shit? Like, where is anything? Like, I'm not drawing into shit right now. Oh, go ahead. I got nothing. You want to go ahead and summon another level 4, go into XC, detach the Mizuki, and fuck me up, then f more power to you, but I don't got shit. Like, uh, like, you said your hand was bad, my hand is fucking trash, man. I, look, look at this, like, I need Polly. I need it. I need Polly, or I need Alpha. Like, Polly or Alpha, that way I can actually do some fucking electromagnetic plays. Two fucking Burzions, and I can't do shit with them right now, because I don't have all the fucking warriors, the electromagnetic warriors. Like, God damn it. Fuck me right now, just fuck me. Your hand is bad. You're, at least you're picking up pace. 
Like that, that you handle my fucking Gorgonic Guard, my second Gorgonic Guardian like a shit. <laughs> Kept it for one last turn. So I believe I milled the top card of my deck. Be great if it was an alpha. Oh, that's one of my well actually that's great, because I didn't want to draw a fucking Valkyrie on again anyway. This is not good. Like I don't have any level four rock earth guys, so. This card just says when he's sent from the field to the graveyard, right? I could Geki him, but then he would still just be so set up that he would just kick the living shit out of me. I don't have any rocks, and I, I still won't have any rocks on Patron, Rock, Earth. Still don't have any of those, can't have any stone on its own. Control level 4 lower, but no, I won't have that either, so. Nope, I didn't draw into anything. Like, wow, you thought your hand was bad. I literally just have fucking a handful of shit I can't use. I needed alpha, I needed fucking a lot of shit, and I didn't get it, so. Might as well just go ahead and scoop it up, like, you got it. I didn't draw anything. Fuck me. Alright, we'll get another duel. We are back. Alright, let's try this again. Like, wow, see? The struggle. I was just talking about, like, you don't get poly, you just struggle. Now, now this hand, now I got poly. Look at the difference between getting poly and now. The King of Slum coming through. Ew, again? One. Oh, that was a lucky guess. <laughs> I mean, usually it's fucking for, uh, uh, Decatron, because, yeah, but, uh, just once again, people opened up with the fucking reasoning. Back it again. Alright, so. And then phase, card gnome summon, you have to add a level 7 or dark, lighter dark monsters level 7, so, red ice. Awesome. Not the greatest thing to add to your hand, but I guess it's not the worst thing either. And literally, the only thing I can do right now is go into my, and go to my condom, because this isn't useful to summon, like, this is probably one of the weaker fucking Magnet Warriors. It really is. Pretty quick now. Damn. So I'll go ahead and fuck you up. He's a light monster, isn't he? So you got honest. I mean, if you activate this, you, you could double hit me. Running Shield, I doubt you're gonna activate anything else this turn, so I'll just go ahead and negate it. And then run your ass over. Unless you have honest, then fuck me. <laughs> if you're honest, then fuck me. Like, literally fuck me, because then I wouldn't even get my effect to summon the two. Like, if I leave the field because of the card effect, then I get my two summons, my double summon. But I would die by battle. I wouldn't get shit. Anyway, teacher, he, he's the opposite of me. Like, he's a, he's a philosophy teacher, psychology teacher. I'm a math teacher. I'm very structured. So we kind of butt heads. We really do. Wow. Like I said, maybe I should just increase the amount of polys to get. Maybe I should. As I said, if King of the Swamp could be a uh, fucking target, that'd be great. That'd be great. You'd be like, Fusion Stop too, but I can't. You know? And I rock that. I believe I have Dapter Monsters on the field, so I can't do him either. Um, this maybe, maybe Polly, because I, I, I mean, I could bust out another one right now. You're not strong like them in this duel, so I guess I'll just go ahead and hold on to my resources and just poke him again for another 4K. When you get this out, it's, it's a huge ass fucking condom. Like, holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I have to say, by opponent's card effect, I was like, I wonder if I can dark hole myself and then summon the two freaking these two and then tack with those two for game. Because I think they'd be, combined, they'd be stronger, right? Because you're 33,000, you're 35? Wow. Wow. I mean, I've seen Red Eyes be fucking inconsistent at times, but wow. Like, we can always try it. I, like I said, it seems like I'd rather have Polly than not have Polly, so. I mean, I literally lost that last duel because I didn't get Polly, so. Yeah, we'll try it. I'll, I'll increase the, the Polly count, so I'll be right back. Alright, this will probably be the last duel. I'm gonna wrap up my story. So, we button heads. He literally, like, in the class, he literally said, oh, I got two of them now. He said, who likes math? No one likes math. No one wants to be a math teacher. And clearly, I wouldn't be a math teacher. Our, 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 our philosophies are different. You know, he likes to do a lot of critical thinking. A lot of, just a lot of fluff in the class, you know? I'm not the biggest fan of it. So, I went, I went the first day, didn't enjoy myself, and I haven't gone since. I've just been doing work at, at, at home, which is totally fine, you know? It's totally fine. Uh, I don't have to go. Like, even if he says, hey, you have to come to class, I can just literally go to administration and go, no, he doesn't. Like, he doesn't have to come to class. He has nothing to do with his freaking class. Uh, his hand's not the best of hands. It's a little slow. I'd say that's my problem. Never mind. I mean, still a little slow, but... Of course, I'm going to go ahead and pop the two cards. Like, it's a, it's, it's not, it's not a slow now. I got Prisma, so it's not as slow. Uh... I need everybody in this hand. The only thing I don't need is the fusion, uh, is the King of Swamps. So. Right, go ahead and pop your back row. I mean, I, it's probably a sure red eyes trap cards anyway. No, it's actually a legit back row. That's your ritual spell, which I don't know why you said that, but now it's a new graveyard, so you can go ahead and banish to add a red eye spell or trap from your fucking deck to your hand, so fuck me. 
but I didn't want you to get that because now you can just get Red Eyes Fusion and that will of course be great and Air Force so great and we'll go ahead and summon you because then you can go ahead and search me for one of the Magna Warriors then I can search summon Prisma and he'll become the other one I got Polly's there's my boss monster right there that's great that's good I'm running the Gorgonic Guardian triple that if I could just special summon that Gorgonic Guardian though I mean, that Gorgon, not Gorgon Guardian, the Gorgon one where if I summon a rock, I special summon it. You've seen me play previously. Go ahead and banish that. Go ahead and grab your red eyes, Jason. Fuck. <laughs> That's totally what I wanted. <laughs> yep. That's not power. Tell me that's not power. Am I dead? Maybe? He just from his hand. I guess he drew the summon skull, so that's not great. But <sighs> wow, pop your card, pop your card. That was pretty smart for you to set that shit. You knew twin horsters, two, pop two. Glad I got rid of the air force though. I couldn't negate it that though. Mm. Yep. I'm not dead, but shh, I'm hurting. I'm hurting. I hurt. Did a nice chunk of damage, and now set some actual back row, right? Now I can still negate that too. No, all right. There it is. I was looking for you. I was looking for you. Now I'm not even going to do this this turn. If, they, if it was this, then I wouldn't even worry. Like, as soon as you would go into battle phase, I would just negate you and put you together. Then I'd still get ran over, but it was only took as much damage. So, there we go. So, go ahead and summon Prisma. Activate Prisma effect. Yes. Go ahead and send out got you. So send you. And poly it up. There we go. I use my normal summon, so I can't do these two. But next turn, I mean, at least I still have a play for next turn. I stop my boss ass boss monster. You're the biggest threat, so I'll go ahead and kill you. You're dead, and now oh, you're kind of hurting for plays. Like, that, that was pretty power. So, the assignments. The assignments are just dragging on, kind of bleh assignments, you know. Every assignment I kind of feel like I really don't want to do, and it's really tiring. Like, I'm not the biggest fan of that, so we're gonna put, get him, put him back. All right, you only get the effect of once per turn, once that time, so you summon your stone, it's not like you contribute it. I wonder if you're going to misplay and do that. I wonder if you're actually going to summon your stone, think you contribute it, summon a seven, and think you're going to go on like Big Eye or something with another red eyes. Like, no. <laughs> only once only once per turn. And only once that turn. So. Yep. So that's something that I can negate during my turn. The King of Swamp. I mean, that's great. It's just I need to build up, you know, those two again. So. I will be summoning you, who will, of course, go ahead and add me some more. Be special summoning you because now I can go into Gorgonic Guardian and Gorgonic Guardian is ha it's his next half the battle. I could get you and then I have all of them, but I think I just want to go ahead and add another Alpha because Gamma is just uh, I get him when I get him, you know. So, once again, Gorgonic Guardian, I don't care about your set card, I can literally negate that. So, like, God, it's so good. Like, you put this fucking condom on, it just feels so good. So, I just did the teacher the survey for the class, you know? And I get I, I don't think I've ever given what does this do? On a level similar to that it was joined intent to make like a special summon this card from your So if you special card from your hand trips, so you do special summon as many destroyed monsters as possible that were destroyed, blah blah blah. I want to say I'm gonna negate that. And then instead of getting greedy because this might be a mirror force, I just won't attack. Like I'll kill you eventually, you know? I only get one negate per turn, so I'll just go ahead and negate and then not attack Gorgon, because if it's a mirror force or Ripple Mirror Force, Dragon's Mirror Force, Air Force, and I already know you're playing Air Force, then, you know, fuck me. Ah, uh, you tribute for cost, I probably should have just bonded on summon. Uh, no, that's fine. You know, summon Red Eyes? I don't care. It doesn't say effect monster, does it? I don't think so. It's really kind. Okay. I'm gonna target one face on monster. Nope, just says target one face on monster, so if you wanna go ahead and do that. Uh, my hair shall feel about that. It's fine. That's fine because you're just gonna come after me anyway. So I'll go ahead and wait till the damage stuff, of course. Bearing damage calc. Detach. Drop you down to zero, negate two, and then you die. So take 16. That that can go off. I'm still debating on that because I haven't negated anything this turn. The last thing I need for him to do is have like a red Yankee, you know, with this last card. So. I think I'll say yes to that. Or are you gonna grab like another red eyes fusion? Like, I'm not sure what red eyes spell or track you can really add at this point. Oh, right, insight. That's fine. Is 
said, I'm kind of worried. Kind of worried. Do you send for costs? Do you send for costs? Do you send for costs? Wow, you sent from your hand? Well, now I know you don't have Regeki. So oh, cool. Oh, cool. I haven't needed that. Then this set card's Regeki. <laughs> That'd be cr- ah! <laughs> That's fine, because I'm just going to go ahead and summon my tuba to fucking summons anyway, but wow. <laughs> I'm for psychic. I was like, no. And I, oh, I set cards. It was Regeki. I mean, I still got it. In the new way, it doesn't matter. Really well. So I'm hitting the class. I did the survey. I haven't given a teacher so many ones like forever. Like, he doesn't do anything. Like, let me let me go into that. I keep on saying like, but let me go into detail. We do work. A lot of work. It's a very accelerated class. A lot of work. There's pretty much work every single week, multiple assignments. We are on week three out of four. We're almost done. He hasn't graded shit. Not a single assignment has been graded put into grade bricks. I don't know my grade. For all I know, I'm, am I doing well? Am I doing bad? Do you like my assignment? Do you not like my assignment? I don't know. No feedback at all. Fucking all. And I get, you know, oh, if you want feedback, go to class. I shouldn't have to go to the class to get fucking feedback. This is an online class. No one said anything about going. This is the, the going to the in the class, that's optional. So you should be keeping on the ball for people who are unable. What for example, what if I have work or something? So I should just sit so this fuck me, you know? So no feedback. Week three, nothing. No feedback at all. I had a question. He said, the quickest way, and first day we went there, the quickest way to get in contact with me is to text message me. Here's my text, here's my cell phone number. I texted him. He never got back to me. Ever. Ever. It's been weeks since I sent that text. It's pretty much irrelevant at this point, but weeks. Where's the text? No way. So, I can't get in contact with him. There's no feedback on fucking shit, so I don't know how well I'm doing on it. I don't know if he likes what I'm liking, what I'm doing. No, I don't know. So I'm just doing what the instructions telling you, and hoping that I do well, you know. And of course, you know, if he doesn't like my fucking shit and my grades and, and my grades drop, then of course my GPA drops and shit like that, you know. This is only my second class, so literally, I'm doing all the work, but I'm not sure if he likes it if I'm getting a grade, if he's going to completion or what. I don't fucking know. So literally, he could be like, "Ah, oh, well, you did it, but I don't really like it." So you know, he gives me like a C on everything. My GPA drops. I lose all my fucking scholarships and shit. Like I'm already in super debt in college. I mean, this is a pain in the dick. So you know, it's just really stressful. So I hate this class. You know, I gave him a one in writing everything. Does he give good feedback? No. Does he give great grades efficiently? Hell no. You know, so I didn't give so many ones. Like I hate this class. I hate him. I can't wait to get out of this fucking class. I'm almost done. Like I'm almost. I'm on my last week. Last fucking. Well, last. Two weeks, you know, we're halfway through this week, week and a half, right? We're almost done. Get out of class, I already got my next my next professor moving on. And hopefully that will be much better. I mean the last class was it was great, you know? I got like he graded my papers, I got feedback, I got hundred percent of that class. This class? I don't know. I don't know. It's the worst man. I might I didn't have to go in actually on Thursday just to see what's up because this is just bullshit. It really is. Like maybe not this Thursday, because it's the third one, but maybe not the next Thursday. But just Fuck me, you know? Just fuck me. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and call it episode daily duel. So, Electromagic Warrior is really strong. Gorgon, strong. Magnum, condom, strong. Uh, I mean, like I said, I increased slime up to three, so maybe that helps. Maybe, like I said, if it could just be substituted through this, you know, in confusion with the above materials and cannot be trusted in my other way. So, I think I tried to use Poly, but his name wasn't because I can't substitute it because it has to be those materials. So, yeah. So his name became one of them, like Prisma, then yeah, we can tell about it doesn't, so I can't really use it. Pretty much he's just used the pitch for Polly, so. Anyway, I'm done. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Dead of Duels. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. I will see you guys tomorrow. Uh, we are playing, um, what are we playing? We're playing Predator Plant variant, of course, because it's still in three monsters. All the new cards, but it's still no Predator, new planet, Predator Plant, so. We'll try what we got, so. Looking forward to that. Alright, people. Thanks for watching.